Hey, this is Elijah with the Oxygen team, and in this video, I'm gonna show you what's new in Oxygen 4.1 Alpha 1. The first thing I wanna talk about is cross-site copy and paste. Ever since we added basic copy and paste support, this has been something that's highly requested by our user base. So as of 4.1 Alpha 1, you'll be able to copy and paste designs across Oxygen sites easily. Let me show you really quickly how that works. In the structure pane, if we select any of our nodes here and click the little pencil icon, we can go ahead and click export, which will copy the elements JSON to our clipboard. We can also hit command or control shift C to copy it to our clipboard. Now over here on this blank oxygen site, I'm going to go ahead and click the import button in the structure pane and paste in that copied JSON. And you can see that it's copied over the design and styles and everything from my other oxygen site. So let's go ahead and grab these other sections as well. So we'll copy that, go over here, and we can click the import button or use command slash control shift I to bring up that dialog and paste the JSON in. And that drops our section in there. Let's grab this one and jump over here and import it as well. And grab our little footer section as our last one. Drop that JSON in and click import. And you can see that we've completely replicated our design across sites. Now, as of the alpha, this cross-site copy and paste does not copy media library items. So you'll see a little bit of an error here when we click that image because it's referencing an ID that doesn't exist in the media library. So if you copy those images over manually, you can then just reselect them once you've pasted your content in. And if we save this and look on the front end, you'll see that our design looks exactly as it did on the original site. So that's going to be a huge time saver. This was previously somewhat possible using the user design library feature, but required a little bit more overhead to get everything set up and a little bit more specific intention in that you had to categorize specific sections and pages and things like that. So this is a lot quicker to go ahead and just grab designs off of one oxygen site and move them over to another. So let's close these out and we'll talk about the next new thing in Oxygen 4.1 Alpha 1, which is field expansion for fields with the none unit. This will be familiar to you if you've played with the size and spacing recently. For instance, if we choose a div instead so that we can see the margin and padding, we can go over here to size and spacing and we can choose the none unit and click in here to type. And you can see that the field expands to the available space so that you can see more when you're doing things like calc or clamp or whatever other complex CSS functions you might wanna use. But previously this field expansion only occurred for certain fields. Now it's been brought to every field where the none unit is available. So we can see it down here with the width and height fields. And if we jump over to somewhere like typography, we can see it with the font size field, which is gonna be really handy for things like clamp. This also applies to global style. So this is gonna be super useful for folks who set up their headings with clamp font sizes so that everything's nice and fluid. Now you'll be able to actually type those long functions and still be able to see exactly what's going on. So really this is just bringing a feature we already had to more places in the UI to make your lives a little bit easier. And finally, we have better revisions management. So we've been working on allowing users to delete revisions, but we've made it a bit more granular in Oxygen 4.1. So let's jump back to the WordPress admin to show you what I mean. If we go down into the Oxygen meta box, we'll see our revisions like we're used to, but now we have a couple new options. We can delete all post revisions or we can delete individual revisions. We previously had issues where some sites would just have a lot of revisions and there wasn't a really easy way to clear them. Well, now you can clear them on a per post basis here or a per revision basis. You can also go to the WordPress admin panel and go to oxygen, settings, and the revisions tab to have a bit more control. Here you can see the maximum number of latest revisions is configurable, so you can drop this number down if you don't wanna store a lot and the maximum number of daily revisions. Basically, we'll retain one revision per day for this many days. And we also have the option to delete all revisions across the entire site. Like I said, this was previously introduced as kind of a stopgap measure. We've left it in because we figure some folks might want to do this in extreme cases where the revisions are causing slowness on the sites, for instance. This will give them the option to do that. 
But as a general rule, you'll probably manage your revisions, as far as deletions is concerned, from the individual posts where they've been created. So that about sums it up for what I have to show you today. Again, this is Elijah with the Oxygen team, and that's what's new in Oxygen 4.1 Alpha 1. Thank you very much for watching.